Hey everyone, I am Nishi and welcome to this channel where I will be posting videos on various programming problems and their solutions. In today's video, we will learn how to create an Android application that helps us detect whether an Android device has screen lock enabled or not. Let's get started. Before going into finding the solution to this problem, let's understand the background of it. Lock screens are used to keep our Android devices secure. In this digital era, we have our email, banking applications installed and logged in on our devices. Our phone is also a room to our photos and important documents. If we keep our phone on some table or desk for some time out of our reach, Anyone who can grab the device will be able to access all our information and use it in a wrong way. Thus, in order to protect our devices from people, having a lock enabled on mobile device is a necessity. Android devices provide us various kinds of locks. Swipe, pin, pattern, password are some of the common locks. Along with this, high-end devices provide fingerprint detection and face detection locks as well. You can change the screen lock of your device by going into settings, searching for screen lock. And moving here where you can set the type of the lock you want. In this video, further, we will learn how to find out whether our lock screen is enabled or not. We will create a simple Android application that helps us detect whether our device is secured or not. As you can see here, I have created a new project in Android Studio with a simple layout that has one activity. We have a text box named Hello World added to the activity but we would like to show in this text box whether device is secured or not. This value will be set from our Java file. Hence, I'll go forward and remove this text from here. Now, I'll move on to the Java file and reference my text view here. I'll reference the text view in the on create of the activity using its ID. Now I will set the value of this text view programmatically using on resume of the application. I'll create a function which returns the string whether the device is secured or not. Here, we'll add our main logic to check whether device has lock enabled or not. Android provides us an API exposed by KeyGuard Manager class to detect whether lock is enabled or not. We will create an object of keycard manager class and set it equal to the handle return from guest system service with keyguard service. We observe that we are receiving a compile time error here. That is because we have not type casted our object return from the get system service API. Let's typecast it. After typecasting with Android Studio, we can observe that keyguard manager class provides us two APIs that is, is device secured and is keyguard secured. So what is the difference between these APIs? Is device secured returns us true if pin, password, or pattern is set and it returns false if they are not. Is key card secured on the other hand returns true for pin, password, pattern as well as SIM lock being set on the device. 
in all other cases it returns false so wondering what the screen lock here is devices provides us a way to lock our sim card as well this can be done from the same screen by scrolling here where we find sim card lock and we can enable this as i'm using an emulator i won't be able to enable this but you can try this out on your actual device as in this video we are finding a solution to detect whether our screen lock is enabled or not for our scenario is device secured is the api that will help us now based on the value returned from here that is either true or false we return the text accordingly to be shown on the device now as we have written the code we can go forward and run this application on our device i'll run the app and as we have currently seen that on emulator no lock is enabled we will observe that it the application marks the device to be not secured there we go here we see that we get the text box with the text device is not secured now let's go to the settings and set the screen lock value let's set it to pin I'll enter one, two, three, four. After entering, we observe that now the screen lock type has been set to pin. We'll go back to our activity, and we see that we observe the text here as device is secured. Thus. today we learned how to find out whether our android device is secured or not do try out using is key card secured api and mention your results in the comment section below that's it folks do like share and comment i'll be back soon with a new video stay safe and keep learning